I find a great store of things. The next day I went to the ship again. This I kept up for more than a week. Every day I brought a load of things to the shore. At last there was nothing left that one pair of hands could lift. But I do believe that if the fine days had held out, I would have brought away the whole ship. You ask how I would have done that? I would have cut it into pieces and brought one piece at a time. The last thing that I found was a secret drawer in the cabin. In that drawer was some money. A part of this money was in gold pieces, pieces of eight, as we called them. The rest was in silver. I smiled to myself when I saw this money. Oh, useless stuff, I cried. What are you good for now? You are not worth picking up. This little old knife is worth much more. I have no manner of use for you. Lie there where you are, and go to the bottom. I was about to leave the cabin when I looked around again. The bright pieces were so pretty that I could not bear to leave them. So I put them in a strong bag and tied it around my waist like a belt. It will not do to throw good money away, I said. When I went up on deck, the wind was blowing hard. Dark clouds were beginning to cover the sky. The waves were rolling high. A storm was coming. I saw that it was time for me to hurry back to the shore. I let myself down into the water and began to swim. The sea was rough. The money was heavy. I hastened home to my little tent. The storm had already begun. <laughs>